the partnership between Politecnico and Dumaray Idols is a partnership of success. With Dumaray is something that really started a long time ago when we were already at General Motors. And now that we moved from GM to Dumaray, this is simply a continuation. The collaboration between Politecnico di Torino and Dumaray represents a blend of industry experience and academic insight. We, as Politecnico di Torino researchers, are teaming up with Dumare to push the boundary of research in hydrogen internal combustion engines. By combining Politecnico research capabilities with Dumare testing infrastructure and experience, we are driving innovation in hydrogen engine technologies. As a leading research university, we are fully committed to contribute to the exchange of knowledge and technologies for sustainable development, and we believe that hydrogen technologies will play a crucial role for the decarbonization. The relationship between academia and industry are really important because they put together the best of what academia has, that is this R&D capability, together with the capability that the industry has to develop a product. When you combine the capability to develop a product together with the technology, then for sure you have a product that is successful. The hydrogen internal combustion engine is a type of engine that burns hydrogen as a fuel. In its simplest configuration, it is quite similar in principle to a gasoline engine and operates by igniting a mixture of hydrogen and air by means of a spark plug. One of the key advantages of hydrogen combustion engine is that they produce only water vapor as a byproduct of hydrogen combustion, making them extremely environmental friendly in terms of exhaust emission. The hydrogen characteristics, and in particular its high flame speed, even for extremely lean mixtures, allow to operate a hydrogen engine at lambda higher than 2, simultaneously achieving high efficiency, low nitrogen oxide emission and high performance. A hydrogen internal combustion engine has a cost that at the end is not that different compared to a diesel. There are no compromises in terms of durability, reliability, payload. We can reuse the same manufacturing footprint, the same skills that are now working in producing internal combustion engines. There are also advantages to the customer. We do not have any more to accept trade-offs or compromises between performance and efficiency or between efficiency and emissions. With a nitrogen engine, we can have both and simultaneously. We developed CFD methodologies to assess the performance of hydrogen fuel internal combustion engines to investigate both injection and combustion phenomena with the aim of selecting the best architecture among several scenarios with increasing level of conversion complexity. Starting from the simplest configuration based on the existing diesel engine, the combustion system has been optimized and also changing the approach for hydrogen injection from port fuel to direct injection. Further extension has been done to include capability to reproduce cycle by cycle variability and to estimate the risk of abnormal combustion events. We have our own facilities with tailored design of the single cylinder engine, also using additive manufacturing technologies, both derived from gasoline and from diesel engines. With our own Dumare V8 100% hydrogen fueled engine, what we did is really trying to have a strong carryover of components. We changed, of course, the boosting system, the sparking and ignition system, the injection system, and we developed our own ECU and controller. In the end, we are able, starting from diesel engines, to get good performances, absolutely excellent emissions with a port fuel and even better with direct injection. It's very important to talk about hydrogen not only as 100% fueling, but also dual fuel solutions. We developed demo vehicles. With this demo vehicle, we reached up to 30% of reduction in CO2. By calibrating properly, we are really able to reach up to 90%. The potential of hydrogen engine can be enhanced by power to enableization. In this framework, we develop a comprehensive digital twin of the vehicle, which can support the selection of a suitable architecture and the design of an energy management system 
capable to exploit vehicle connectivity, allowing for the reduction of both vehicle fuel consumption and emissions. To succeed in engineering, innovation is key. Academic partners like Politecnico are really fundamental in uh, helping us in this journey to be always on the leading edge of the technology. Relationships between academia and the industrial world are essential to create a network of collaborations within an ecosystem based on knowledge and aimed at spreading innovation. This is also bringing added value to the university and academia because then you can really see your technology in something that will be sold. This is not just pure research, but it's really industrial research.